Taking the immunity deal was definitely a good move for Lil Woody, cause he had already been labeled as a snitch before the trial even kicked off. Back in 2023, a three hour long interrogation with Lil Woody leaked online, and that's when the situation started looking bad for him. According to reports, the interrogation was from 2021. Lil Woody had been picked up on a charge for carrying a gun as a felon and was facing serious time, and that's when he offered to work with the cops and help them take Young Thug down. Lil Woody told the detectives, The information I had, they didn't want to hear right now. I mean, we can have it to them. You say you're best, you something will happen today. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Somebody's supposed to get killed tonight. The cops asked Lil Woody for more details, and Lil Woody told him that there was a dude that Young Thug wanted dead. Lil Woody even offered to get on the phone with one of his homies while the cops were watching so they could confirm what was about to go down. It was clear that Lil Woody was desperate to get out of the situation and was ready to give up anybody if the cops would let him go. Lil Woody told the cops, Right now, you need to hit a social more and he moving different. It's hard to keep up with how he moving. What do you mean? So he, 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 he just, he not moving how he used to, he used to move. Reckless. He moved different. But he wanted this nigga so bad that he moved his back reckless. Lil Woody even said that Young Thug was rich and stupid, and that's why he hated being around him.